Worldview healing is the first grassroots solution for consciousness change, consciousness elevation. This is also known as the techniques of shamanism. Shamanism is essentially indigenous culture's name for worldview healing. These are worldview healers. They are medicine men in the true sense. Uh, people who practice indigenous tribal medicine. And it's not just medicine for healing the body. It's medicine for healing the spirit, for healing the soul, for healing our worldview. This is a great slide I found online. The opposite of good is not evil. The opposite of good is apathy. It's apathy combined with ignorance and combined with laziness that creates everything that ails us, everything that, we, that creates our suffering. Apathy, ignorance, laziness. These are the real evils of the world. These are what are born of a negative worldview, an unconscious worldview. So we need to heal that. We need to get over our apathy. Care is the grand architect of the universe. It's what bears everything into manifestation, what we care about. And we have to examine what we care about, what we're focused on, and what the, the real goal of what we're trying to achieve in the world really is. Is it our own personal comfort? Or is it really the alleviation of suffering for everyone here? Because we recognize we're all in this together. We're all one consciousness experiencing itself subjectively. And everyone else's suffering is also our own suffering. That is what conscience really means. That's what real responsibility is, is that understanding. And we need to get to that level of consciousness if we're ever going to truly unify and be one world, recognize that we're actually all one consciousness. That will be accomplished through healing our worldview and understanding that human nature is in fact good, that we need to live in harmony with natural law, and that change is in fact possible. To think positively and know that it is possible for the caterpillar to become the butterfly. We can make a transformation and a metamorphosis if we use the power of our will and the power to ascend the higher levels of consciousness to accomplish that.